Hey everybody, I'm here today with a complete driving tutorial on gas pedal control. In this video, I'll be going over the basics and the more detailed and advanced stuff with regards to gas pedal control. Let's get right into the video. As you can see, we have two pedals here. We have a brake pedal to the left, a gas pedal to the right. This is an automatic car. If I was driving a manual car, I would have a clutch pedal to the far left over here, but I don't. So we're going to be focusing on this pedal right here, which is the gas pedal. It's the one all the way to the right. And when you push it, it's going to be the pedal that moves the car either forward or backward so here's the deal the brake pedal slows the car down and stops the car the gas pedal or accelerator pedal will actually move the car forward or back okay it will rev the engine it will make the engine uh, go basically okay so let's get right into the video the first thing that I want you to do is put the car in park now put the car in park and make sure your emergency brake is on just in case uh, in case you made a mistake and then I want you to push the gas pedal and listen to what you hear now you'll hear that the engine is revving. Now if you do this in park, the car should not move anywhere. So if you push the gas pedal in park, the car should not move. Now take a look at the RPMs over here, okay? As you can see, when I push the gas pedal, the RPMs jump up, the engine revs. It, it actually goes, basically. Now if I push the gas pedal a little bit, it's just gonna move a little bit. But if I push the gas pedal a lot, it's gonna move a lot and the engine gets much louder. So basically, to sum it up, okay, the basics is, uh, the basics are, I should say, if you push the gas pedal a little bit, your acceleration is gonna be low. Your car is gonna move forward slowly at a slow rate of acceleration. If you push the gas pedal much more, then your car is gonna move forward much faster at a much faster rate of acceleration. Now here's the deal. You should be consistent with your gas pedal, meaning you don't wanna be pushing it like this. You wanna be consistent. So here's a little exercise that you can do to get consistent with your gas pedal. And then I'll demonstrate myself pushing the gas pedal while I actually drive the car. Okay, so here it is you want to push the gas pedal down a little bit and look at your tachometer and see if you can hold the rpms at certain levels so right now i'm holding it at about 2500 rpm release okay you want to see if you can do that with other rpms as well so i'm going to go ahead rev it up a little bit higher i'll try and hold it at about four as you can see right there. And what's going on there when you hear that vroom, 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 is the engine is actually limiting how high I can rev the car. So meaning I, you know, it's telling me I can't go above four. I'm pushing the gas pedal a lot, but the engine is just saying four, four, four. It doesn't want me to go higher while I'm revving in park. And that's very common in modern engines. They don't want you to over rev and they don't want you to launch the car or anything like that. I mean, you know, no, most modern cars that's gonna happen, but you wanna be consistent about when you're holding the gas pedal. So you can see right here, I'll hold it at about 2000, just like that. And just practice doing that over and over again. Now, before I demonstrate, I'm gonna explain one goal of uh, gas pedal control. What you want is you want to go from zero to whatever your goal is uh, at a consistent rate. So if I, zero means not pushing it at all, your goal would be how much you want to push it. Let's say my goal was right here, right? I would want to go from zero to there consistently. You don't want to be like, uh, I don't know what's going on here. You want to go from zero to that point consistently. Okay. So I'm just going to demonstrate with my hand for just a quick moment. Um, and then I'll demonstrate myself actually driving with this gas pedal control. So basically if zero is not pushing the gas pedal at all. And this is where I want it to be. I want to go from here to here at a consistent rate. I don't want to be like, uh, I don't know what to do. You want to be like this. And if you need to floor it and your goal is here, you want to be able to go like that. Not like, eh, I'm not sure. You want to just be consistent, okay? You want to be consistent with your speed that you're pushing the gas pedal and the amount of force that you're applying. So let's just do a quick little check for traffic. I'm going to inch forward, then I'll demonstrate myself pushing the gas pedal. So I'm going to try and hold the camera as steady as I can, uh, but bear with me if I, you know, show like the side of the door for a second or something as I'm as I'm driving. So what we're going to do is we're going to go on to this completely empty side street over here. This is what I'm doing with the gas pedal. I'm barely pushing it because I'm moving slowly. So this is what it looks like when I'm I'm just basically moving on to the side street right here. Okay. Sorry about that. There we go. I'm uh, just pushing the gas pedal barely at all. If you want more acceleration, you push the gas pedal a bit more. And if you floor it, you're going to get the maximum acceleration from the car. 
Very, very simple and straightforward. The more that you push the gas pedal, the more acceleration that you'll get. Now I'm gonna demonstrate what I'm gonna do with the gas pedal just as I make this little turn right here. Keep an eye on that gas pedal right there. This is what it looks like. Pushing the gas pedal just a bit. And because this is an automatic car, as I just hold the gas pedal here, the car is consistently increasing in speed. I'm going 29, 30, blah, blah, blah. Increasing, increasing, increasing. And I'm gonna brake. The goal here is to keep practicing, okay? I cannot emphasize this enough. And I'll show you my face in just a moment because I know that's probably what you wanna see instead of me shakingly holding this camera over here. Okay, so basically the more that you push the gas pedal, the more acceleration that you're gonna get. And the goal is to practice as much as you possibly Possibly can because the more that you practice let's just move forward a little bit further over here the more that you practice the better off that you'll be controlling that gas pedal now like I said I did my best with the uh, holding the camera steady right there but the idea is that hopefully you saw what I was doing with the gas pedal that was basically me just driving regularly uh, while showing you the gas pedal. The idea here is you wanna be consistent in the amount of force. You wanna be consistent in your speed from going from zero to your goal of how much you wanna push that gas pedal. The more that you push it, the faster you'll accelerate. You want maximum acceleration, you gotta floor the gas pedal. You want just a little bit of acceleration, you gotta push it down just a bit. And my last tip is to plant your heel on the ground. Because if you are, you know, your foot is not with your heel on the ground, it's gonna be hard for you to to be consistent and to push it with a consistent amount of pressure. But if you plant your heel on the ground and you just worry about moving your foot, that's how it's gonna work. I'll demonstrate just right here, give you a quick idea. If I am trying to uh, move the gas pedal here, right? And I don't have my heel on the ground, it's gonna be hard for me to get the same amount of pressure, okay? But if I plant my heel on the ground, I'm just going like this, it's much easier for me to get a consistent amount of pressure. And that's it. That is the full complete tutorial for gas pedal control. If you like the video, be sure Sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching